Hi, I'm Tim Gibson. I'm going to talk to you about how to install a wood fence. First thing we need to do when we're installing wood fence is we need to lay out uh, the perimeter of the fence and take our measurements uh, to determine how long each run is. And then we need to set up and we need to determine the spacing on our posts. Now typically, you know, your spacing on your posts would be anywhere from five feet up to eight feet. And what you want to do is you want to choose an equal spacing uh, that works well with your layout. So in other words, if you've got a 24 foot uh, length on one side, you can use eight foot lengths and you'd have three sections uh, of fencing going down through there. If you had 30 across the back, well, you may want to use uh, six foot post uh, for your spacing there so you can keep them even just so you know where your posts are. Now when we set our posts uh, what we want to do is we want to dig holes we want to locate those and you will take a, a large uh, tape measure and you want to lay it out there you want to locate your holes and what's really good is a can of fluorescent spray paint they even make some special spray paints that uh, are marker paint uh, for marking where your holes go. So you mark all those. If you're using a 4x4 post, then you want to dig a hole that is 12 inches in diameter, and then you want to dig those holes deep enough where it's below the frost line. So you'll need to check and see what the frost line typically is for your areas, but that hole is going to be anywhere from 16 inches to 24 inches deep, uh, depending on uh, your local conditions. Uh, when we install our posts, we want to make sure that they are, are plumb, uh, this gadget uh, that actually is a level on both sides allows you to plumb uh, both sides of your of your post just rubber bands onto it so it makes it easy for installing your post. The next thing we do is we've got to install the runners for the fencing to attach to. You have an upper runner and you have a lower runner so those would be uh, nailed uh, using uh, spiral nails or you can use deck screws uh, attaching those to the post and then once we get all those set and we want to make sure those are all level they follow the contour of the land and uh, then we'd come back and put our slats on so in this case we've got a privacy fence so we've got our boards uh, and when these are set you want to set them with just a little bit of spacing to allow for expansion and contraction between the boards usually an eight penny nail uh, works fine for your spacing on these and then these can either be nailed or screwed to your runners. So I'm Tim Gibson and that's how to install a wood fence.